ओके डी स्टूडेंट्स लेट अस सी व्हाट इज हैपनिंग इन दिस क्वेश्चन व्हेन अ साउंड वेव ट्रैवल्स फ्रॉम अ रीजन ऑफ हॉट एयर टू द रीजन ऑफ कोल्ड एयर इट रिफ्रैक्ट्स एज शोन सो इट रिफ्रैक्ट्स एज शोन व्हाट चेंजेस अकर इन द फ्रीक्वेंसी एंड द वेवलेंथ ऑफ द साउंड एज इट पासिस फ्रॉम हॉट एयर टू कोल्ड एयर सो माय डी स्टूडेंट्स आई हैव चेकड दिस क्वेश्चन थॉरली एंड आई हैव चेकड द आंसर्स विद द मार्क स्कीम आल्सो so i know the answer and everything but the problem is like this question is problematic there is a big problem here and the solution for that problem is that this is not this will not happen in the case of sound wave well this would be like it would be correct if it was for any other wave like electromagnetic wave light microwave radio wave whatever but not in the case of longitudinal wave not in the case of sound wave and there is a reason for it so first of all uh, to understand that i would be explaining this thing so please be careful now okay like the first thing that we need to note is like whenever a wave is traveling the medium in which the velocity is lesser we call it denser like for example we say that this medium is optically denser this medium is optically a uh, rarer so what do you mean like we are not actually talking about the density we talking about the velocity of the wave so if the velocity of wave is lesser the medium is known as the medium is known as denser and if the velocity is more the medium will be rarer okay as we know like for for example in the case of light uh this the the light is traveling at the speed of light like 3 into 10 to power 8 when we talk about air which is the rarest of the mediums and then let us say the the light enters into water or enter into glass or any other medium the speed reduces so when the speed reduces we start calling it denser so it will be denser now in the case of sounds we have to first see what is happening so hot air so the speed of the sound the formula is given by gamma rt by m like this is really a high level formula and this is not required in the in the ib it is not required anything just for the sake of argument i'm doing this thing so velocity is directly proportional to square root of temperature it means uh, hot air like more is the temperature more is the speed so the speed here is more and speed here is lesser so lesser speed means that cold air will be treated as denser medium for the sound and this would be treated as rarer medium this is the first thing now that the light is like the sound wave is moving from the rarer to denser now the second thing that is very important is that in the case of sound the refraction takes place in the opposite sense opposite sense means that let us say this is the denser medium and this is the rarer medium and if the light is trying to enter into it like this so when it will enter into denser medium it will bend towards the normal so this is light but if we talk about sound wave ironically the sound wave bends away from the normal so this would be bending away from the normal so if the sound is coming from the same line it will go like this so this direction will be for the sound first of all we have to understand this phenomena the refraction in the case of sound is opposite to that of the light you won't believe me you have to go for google and then you can check it out i checked out couple of images but i don't really want to show it because of copyright issues and all those but otherwise um this thing i'm like really sure about this thing so first of all like if this is the denser medium this is the rarer and you talking about sound wave the diagram is wrong but let us say that we are not talking about the sound wave we are talking about light waves or something or like only the white light or any other light is coming so in this case we can say that yes when it will bend like this it will bend towards the normal the frequency is always unchanged when the medium is changed like obviously you can say that frequency means color frequency means the color of the light like for example there is a bulb a red colored bulb that is inside the swimming pool and so if you will start it it will look red when you are inside the swimming pool or it will be still looking red if you're out of the swimming pool isn't it so the frequency doesn't matter frequency doesn't change and the light is a function of frequency only and that is why the frequency will definitely be unchanged 
Now the other thing is wavelength. Now what do you we what what do we want to say about wavelength? Let us see. Now there will be the refractive index. Now if I'm treating this as a denser medium, the refractive index will be denser. So mu is equal to the speed of light divided by the speed of light in that medium. So again, we have a formula C is equal to lambda into F. We just substitute it here. Lambda original into F divided by the new lambda into F. And F and F gets cancelled out because frequency is unchanged. And thereby I can say that if mu is greater than 1, so <clears throat> lambda naught by lambda is greater than 1, lambda naught is greater than lambda. It means the wavelength will reduce and hence the answer will be this. And so the answer should be B. Now the problem with this question is that technically speaking, the question is not right. Technically, the question is not right. Instead of sound wave, it should be light wave. Then everything will fall in place. Okay, and why I'm saying so? Because let us check the mark scheme. What is the answer? And according to the mark scheme, the answer given is B. So that is why I'm sure about this thing that this question is wrong at this point. Like, let us say, if this question is not wrong, like uh, uh, it is a sound wave only and we have to take this. First of all, the diagram is wrong. Second thing, the answer cannot be the same. So that is why I say that it will be light wave, not the sound wave. Okay, my dear students, this is Professor Varun. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel. All the best. Bye.